The sudden death of Mr. Coolidge came as a painful shock to all Americans, for the ex-president had appeared in good health and form during the last year. Only a few weeks ago he made one of his rare appearances in the political field to urge his fellow countrymen to re-elect President Hoover. If initiating proposals and securing their adoption constitutes leadership, President Hoover is a leader. No man in modern life better exemplified the rule that silence is golden, with the result that in retirement every word he uttered was regarded as of priceless sagacity. His contributions to the American press were the highest paid in the world. Mrs. Coolidge was his constant companion, and for Americans he typified the old Puritan spirit of their ancestors. His term of office synchronized with a period of the greatest prosperity ever known in the world, but he himself preserved through it all an austere and simple outlook on life, his chief pastime being fishing, at which he was an adept. Thank you.